It was a blissful morning as the congregation comprising of religious and political leaders, business people and the Christian community at large gathered to witness the groundbreaking ceremony of the new cathedral for Mukono Diocese. At the event which commenced with a service, the Archbishop of Church of Uganda, the Most Reverend Dr. Stephen Samuel Kazimba Mgalu, recognized the founders and predecessors who were instrumental in laying the foundation of the diocese and bringing it to its current state. We give thanks to God. But he is building on the foundation which was built by Tata Nkoyo. But we must remember also the office which has been here, which was the first office for the diocese of Mukono, was built by Kanuniwas Senoga with the others. Yes. The Archbishop also advised Christians to be patient with life because they do not know what God has in store for them. You see, God's ways of doing things are incomprehensible. Let me tell you, there is something you would have loved to be done now. And God says, it will not be now. It will be your son. It will be your daughter. So just prepare. While elucidating the importance of the cathedral's construction, the Archbishop appealed to Christians to generously contribute towards its development with a cheerful spirit. That's why we need Jesus. If we are to build this church, Christ should build our internal house inside. And save us. And you will not have any problem of finishing this church. God bless you. The Deputy Speaker of Parliament, who was the Chief Guest, also acknowledged the works that Church of Uganda is doing to enable development in the country, for instance, in the education sector through the construction of Uganda Christian University. He thus assured the Church of continued support towards its projects. your grace for partnering with government strongly on issues of education because it's from such that we are able to raise uh, people who can contribute big uh, to these products. To these projects. He also extended his thanks to the Church of Uganda for being exemplary in not only preaching the word of God but also enforcing the need for Ugandans to be hardworking. Uh, some of us were getting scared that there are churches which have taken a route of telling people that it's all about prayer without working hard. <laughs> Taebo appreciated the Archbishop for being a symbol of unity in the country. Agara Kusima is grace at a personal level for being a symbol of unity. So, unity, religion should be bringing unity. God is aiming at uniting people. At the fundraising event, the Deputy Speaker of Parliament handed in his and the President's contribution of 10 million and 20 million respectively, totaling to 30 million for the start. He also called on the community to give to the church in order to aid the project. The congregation then witnessed the groundbreaking of the new Mukono Diocesan Cathedral as the day also marked the 39th anniversary since the creation of the diocese with its fifth bishop, Right Reverend Enos Chito Kagodo, marking one year in service. <laughs> Ah, 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 ah,